I'm going to show you how to add a people currently watching this item feature to your Shopify store with no app, no plugin, completely for free. It's just going to be a random number. It's not going to be the real number, but it does help increase conversion rate. It looks a little bit like this here, where it says 24 people are looking at this item right now. And you'll be able to find all of the instructions in the document in the description. So this is a very, very simple process. I'm going to run through this very, very slowly so that people can understand. What you want to do is you want to go to online store. Uh, if you can't find online store, you have to click on sales channels and then click on online store in the Shopify backend. And then you want to press these three little buttons here, press edit code. Now I'm just going to close everything. So mine looks like yours and we want to add a new asset. Okay. So we'll just search for asset and then you'll see it says assets and then you just want to press add new asset create a blank file and then we'll follow the instructions at the same time it says .js so the extension is .js and then the name of the file is people watching so we'll put people watching .js and then press done this will create a new javascript file for us and then all we want to do is grab this code here now if this doesn't work which is possible okay it does work so it's fine but if not, you can scroll down and there's a markdown version of this uh, a little bit further down, which you can also follow. So I'm going to press save here and you'll see all it does is create a random number between five and 50. And it says that's how many people are currently watching your website. So the second thing, modify the main product.liquid file. So again, we'll search main product.liquid file. This is an app that I think costs $15 a month. I'm showing you how to do this completely for free. What you want to do is you want to control F and look for title, and this will take you to subtitle right here. Click above this P tag here, okay? Because you don't want to put it inside a P, the same P tag. So we'll press enter once here, and then we just want to insert this HTML code right here. At the very bottom of this file, we want to put script source equals people watching .js. So I'm going to scroll all the way down to the bottom under this schema schema. Then I'm going to press save here. And then I'm going to press preview store. I'm going to close everything. And then if I just open a random product, so we'll open this, we'll see 48 people are looking at this item right now. That's literally it, guys. It's that simple. Now all of the products will have a random amount of people looking at the product right now. I'm actually going to leave this on two men because it does actually increase conversion rate. So we'll see if that actually helps. That's the end of this tutorial, guys. Thank you so much for tuning in. If you want to see more tutorials like this, then there will be a playlist in the description where I'm going to show you how to do all of the things that you want to do on your Shopify store without those pesky plugins using simple code and explained very easily. Thanks for watching, guys, and peace out. If you're enjoying this video, please consider subscribing to Harbor. Harbor is a software that basically has my brain inside it that we're working on right now and we're trying to make it the best possible AI SEO tool on the market. You guys know how much I care about making something meaningful. That is the whole point of Harbor. We are really, really trying to make something meaningful and we'd love to have you along for the ride. Hopefully see you there. Less.